Hello, good morning, and welcome to the School 3 News. It is Wednesday, June 17th, boys and girls. Six more days to go. Six more school days. You can do it. If you haven't done IXL, please get on and do the diagnostic. Make sure you go into your teacher's Google Classrooms. Don't forget your specials, art, music, gym, library, health, Spanish, and fifth and sixth grade instrumental music. Now on to the news. And now, this day in history. This day in history, 1885. I finally arrived to New York Harbor. I was a gift to the United States from the good people of France. I arrived in over 350 different pieces, in 200 cases, and then they put me together. I was made of copper and iron, and I cost $250,000. Doesn't seem like a lot, right? But if that money were converted to today, it would be $5.5 million. So, I'm a pretty expensive statue. I'm 305 feet tall, and I weigh 450,000 pounds. For those of you who don't know my name, I am Lady Liberty, the Statue of Liberty. And I'm not really in New York. Jersey. Shh. It'll make New York feel bad. It is National Eat Your Vegetables Day. That's right. Eat all of your veggies. They're good for you. I'm not a huge fan. But I'll eat a salad like this. Mm-mm-mm. Veggies. Yeah. National Cherry Tart Day. Never had a cherry tart, but this looks pretty good. Gonna have to uh, figure out where to get a cherry tart around here. A good one. That way I can taste it. Looks good. Cherry Tart Day. National Apple Strudel Day. Yeah. Good stuff. I don't know what else to say. Apple strudel. Yummy. Ooh, apple strudels. I think there's like a Pop-Tart version of a strudel or something. I don't know. Something like that. Not the real thing, but close enough if you can't get your hands on real strudel. Comes with a little packet with icing. Put it on and I don't know. Pillsbury maybe? I don't know. Something. I saw it somewhere. Strudel. 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 Apple strudel. It's good. Trust me. Make sure you enjoy that weather. 78 degrees today. But we've got some rain in the forecast coming in the next couple of days. So enjoy it while you can. And that wraps it up for this edition of the School 3 News. Stay safe and stay classy, Belleville.